Well, the last thing most drivers in a hurry want to do is get stuck in traffic, but for one borough in Union County, you typically don't have much of a choice. Eyewitness News reporter Morgan Parrish joins us live in our central Pennsylvania newsroom to tell us how the community is hoping to alleviate some of that congestion. Morgan. Nick, good evening. The problem is in Lewisburg, where increasing numbers of large trucks has become a major problem. So now homeowners and business owners are pulling their efforts to try and find a solution. Market Street in Lewisburg is a hot spot for shoppers, visitors, and tourists. With small boutiques and eateries, it's the place to be. The problem is... Yeah, there's a lot of traffic, a lot of, well, lot of trucks, go, yeah. a lot of trucks, and they're really noisy and it screws up the uh, um, street lights yeah, too. Yeah. Now, a local citizens group is raising money to pay for a corridor study of Market Street to see what might can be done to ease the congestion. Kim Wheeler, a member of the committee, tells me the streets downtown were never constructed in a way to accommodate these huge trucks. Well, it's really very hard for the people that live here to have trucks and buses and this big heavy equipment going down the main street. Well, it's it's uh, very crowded around here. It's always tough to get through here. Not only is the traffic a concern, but the air quality is too. Community members say all those trucks exhaust is leaving soot on their historical buildings. It destroys the feeling. It really does. And this is an absolutely gorgeous town. I mean, it, it just yeah. wonderful. Because it's really, you know, distracting the business people and also you know the people that come here they want to avoid it at all costs until the study can be paid for and conducted locals offer up these suggestions drive less bike more it would make sense i think to have a, a side street you know well there are other routes that they could possibly take Poss you know when they come over the bridge Kim Wheeler of the citizens group behind the study says another part of the problem comes from another highway project on Duke Street in Northumberland Borough. She also says there's no time frame on when the study is getting started. In the Central Pennsylvania Newsroom, Morgan Parrish, Eyewitness News. You can feel the frustration of the locals there. All right, Morgan, thanks. And the group says the study will cost six figures, but so far they've raised just a little bit more than $50,000.